still more? Oh yeah, if you, if you keep turning it needs more. Well, I've been a little bit short on videos since uh, since Christmas time. I'd like, I'd like to try to get out at least a couple videos a week. Uh, but this week I've had a unusually difficult task. Our, uh, um, our water well pump went out. We actually are working off of city water, but we've got water storage. And, and so the city water will fill up our tank, but it's not enough to get the water upstairs because uh, we have virtually no pressure here to speak of so uh, we have it there's a pump motor that the, the shallow well pump motor that'll, that pumps up our compressed tank uh, it's got about a 40 pound 38 to 40 pound pressure in it uh, once it's it's full and that's what gives us our push to upstairs here but the whole house runs on it so if if that pumps out nothing works uh, it's just the way the house is uh, piped. Uh, so we've been working on that all week and finished it up uh, yep, late yesterday. And as we were working, uh, we we got a, a Rose took a couple of clips of it uh, as as we could as we were having having so much fun. Uh, I hate plumbing. Plumbing is the worst job in the world for me. Uh, and even toward the end of this movie, you'll see the video. You'll see that. A couple of the fittings were still leaking, but we, we got them fixed now. But uh, And here, um, there's no grinding system. So the water well um, had so much electrolysis, and I'd take a fitting apart and try to replace it. And if it was in the elbows, then the electrolysis had eaten the elbow up, and I didn't have a, a tap, three-quarter inch tap, to retap the elbow. So we spent two, three days going back and forth between the parts house until we could get all the right fittings and I ended up having to get some stainless steel fittings so uh, it, it could be able to cut those the elbows on the, the, ba the bad foraging on those uh, Chinese elbows um, the, the, in America I had problems with the elbows and, and the couplings that uh, galvanized couplings that were made in China they'll usually tell you on the elbow the made in China I just throw them back in the bin and I wait until I can find something that's American made. It was always cut better. Okay, well, on with the video. You'll see me assembling a few parts and then uh, kind of work at it as we go. Uh, but uh, that's what we've been doing all week. It's rather expensive. Uh, the time we got through is about 11,500 pesos for the whole job, and that's with me doing the work. And I know if those guys, if I would have hired it out to get somebody to come in here and do it responsibly like I do, uh, and they saw that the, the, the uh, electrolysis on all those pipes and fittings, they would have just wrapped more tape around it and hope it wouldn't leak. And it probably wouldn't for maybe a week. And then once they're gone and they're paid, then, then I've got to go back in and redo it again. So we took the extra time and did it ourselves. Wow, what a long intro. Ooh. Okay. Um... Here are the clips. I'm going to put them all together, and thanks a lot, guys. Bye-bye. Finishing up the last of installing the uh, check valve, one way check valve on it. Um, Got lid glue there. You have a check valve here. It's one way. It only allow water in one direction, and it'll keep it from back, back flushing to the tank. 
you have it in the wrong way, when you kick the pump on, it's going to push the water out. So we've got to make sure that the pressure that the valve is in the right direction. So we use bronze because they're better. They they have less less problems with them. And we have a stainless steel union. They paid a little extra money for it, but the stuff that I was they had it uh, from the parts distributor in China. It was junk. The fitting was junk, and it wasn't machine right. So instead of having that Chinese junk in here, I got a better one. The way we can put it apart and take, hope we don't have to take it apart again. Okay, got that done. Make sure check valves the right direction. Okay, now we're ready to put this assembly into the pump and tighten it down and then go on to the next project. Okay. Still more? Oh yeah, if you, if you can keep turning it needs more. Okay, let me, uh, let me try it. <sighs> Alright, turn it on. Hmm? Turn it off, the camera. Okay. Alright guys, i got my crew hard at work here. I'm exhausted, I, we worked hard yesterday and I don't have any strength left. I'm still with this heart failure. I still don't have any energy, so I got my crew here and they're helping me with it. There you go. Very good, girl. Okay, now that you've got that big old board there, take the take the big. Uh, Press a big pipe wrench. This. Yeah. Move the board over here a little bit more. Button it that way. Oh. Away from the work. No, this way. Move the board that way. There. Right there. Now that'll give you plenty of room to work. And use your... There. There. Okay, open your wrench up just a little more so it'll get a bigger bite and not slip on you. If it slips on you, your hands get going on that concrete wall. Okay. Okay. All right, girls. <laughs> Gee, wasn't that fun? <laughs> All right. Thank you. Let's, uh, All right, let's get it in place, girl. Pick up, pick it up. Okay, check and see if your O-ring is still there. Okay, but it's not gonna fit square, is it? This is bigger. It's taller. Okay. Go ahead and shut the camera up.
alright guys uh, finally we finished we were finished up and uh, it's a hard work you know because uh, instead we pay someone else we were just do it on ourselves so we we don't have to pay someone and also um, the work also some uh, uh, good uh, good uh, work because if we hire someone else you know if you see this part of a fitting in here uh, inside the, this one is a brand new one because we buy we change we, we change that uh, if we let someone else to work uh, they're just put it on take it off and then put a uh, tape on uh, tape and then it doesn't say anything about oh that was a bad it's rusted already so that was a filipino work here so <laughs> i'm glad we were just work uh, mike and i we were helping and also he put this uh nice uh fancy switch yeah it's very nice work so he was uh good and uh but well, finally that's our day and uh, today is um, Monday morning and we are finished to do this finally so that was it uh, it's a uh, kind of a uh, hard work but uh, uh, I'm glad we're done so that was it for now and uh, uh, thank you for uh, watching and please like and subscribe. You know